uh, in the workplace, uh, as you start to get to know your coworkers, you can really tell uh, who's, who's having up days and down days uh, because you get to know them and there's a rhythm with everybody and you can sort of see their rhythm. Uh, and so you'll have the opportunity to know when someone is not uh, up to par today. Uh, and, and some of those people are, are not responders, so they're not naturally going to come and talk to you if they're having down days. If you see someone in crisis, or if someone comes to you and starts to just share uh, when they may not normally do that, uh, that's just a trigger for you to say, hey, this is a spiritual moment. This is, this is something God created in advance for me to take advantage of right now, for me to let them know I'm gonna pray for them, or, or maybe uh, ask permission if I can have my church be praying for them, uh, and just take that crisis situation and show care and concern, but also bring it spiritual. Reggie. Hey, Reggie. Hey, Jeremy. How you doing? Good. How's it going, man? Going well, going well. How are things going with you? Well, uh, you know, it's been a rough time. Uh, really? But, uh, yeah, you know, just got a lot going on right now. Bring in prayer. Bring in God in some way into that conversation because they're at critical mass if they're sharing something and they're a responder and all of a sudden now they're sharing something really personal and, and needing and they're crying out uh, to please love me or help me or uh, respond to that and realize that they are asking you uh, because they, they don't know where to go. Um, I don't know if you heard, but uh, my father's sick. Um, no, I didn't hear that. Yeah, he's been sick, you know, the last six or eight months, but it's really been getting bad here the last uh, you know, two, three, two, three weeks. When people are there, that's God. That's, that's the Holy Spirit working in that person's life, and he brought them to you <laughs> so that you can pray with them. It's like an honor. God, God picked them out for you to talk to, to pray with today, and, and be alert and ready for that opportunity God made for you so you can have that prayer in the parking lot. Definitely can relate to that, having a parent who's gone through sickness as well. Yeah. You mind if we have a prayer? No, not at all. It's your, it's your father? Yeah, it's my father. Okay, let's go to prayer. Dear Father, we pray for Jeremy's father who's going through sickness right now. We ask, Lord God, that you touch his body. It's a beautiful vignette just to show all of a sudden, uh, you know, someone comes out of nowhere and says a crisis with the family, and, and, and the person can relate to it because God put them through family situations where they have concern and real empathy so that they could have that spiritual bonding and prayer together. And I know their relationship will grow further as a result of that. Both of their relationship with God will grow further as a result of that prayer. Father God, be with him during this time and help him through those hard times. Father God, send your son. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Ready, man, I appreciate it. Amen. Thank you, so much. All right, Jeremy. Yeah, good seeing you. Contact, man. Yeah, we'll see right. you tomorrow. Take care.